We have new update on NIO ET7, friends. The first NIO ET7 electric car's body rolls off the production line, and NIO expects the sale of ET7 to start within about 12 months. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Harayan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel for daily AV news and ring the bell so you don't miss my coverage. And if you find this report informative, please share in social media, like it, and give us thumbs up. So Mark Kane reports in Inside is that NIO has shown the first ET7 body in white uh, BIW that has rolled off the production line on April 1st, just a few days ago of 2021 at the JAC NIO Hefei Advanced Manufacturing Center in China. Uh, the, you're seeing it on your screens. The ET7 electric vehicle is an all new flagship sedan, actually the first sedan from NIO after three SUVs, EC8, EC6 and EC... Um, ES6 uh, unveiled in January of this year and scheduled for market launch in the first quarter of 2022 and NIO um, is showing the first body in white uh, uh, body of the uh, ET7 by the way speaking of NIO's uh, spec not ET7 specs check on our channel uh, the detailed specs that I have a report on that if you just search on Google NIO ET7 search uh, ET7 specs or on YouTube now the long way that ET7 carries over the essence of NIO's technology and further improves the manufacturing techniques, efficiency, and vehicle mass without compromising its performance. Um, ET7 body in white is a vivid embodiment of high performance safety and economy. During the on-site review, the quality of the body in white of the ET7 was praised by many as beyond expectations this product wouldn't have come through without the joint efforts of all cross-function teams. While the electric vehicle competition is getting fierce, we look forward the ET7 can become another great NIO success, says the, uh, the press release that NIO shared. Now, you know, friends, it will be very interesting to see the NIO ET7 on the market as it might be a very strong competitor to the European and North American battery electric vehicles. Moreover, NIO announced that besides the 70 kilowatt hour and 100 kilowatt hour battery options, there will be a next generation 150 kilowatt battery option available around the late 2022, consisting of ultra high energy density solid state cells. Now, stay with me because I'm going to tell you about when NIO will unveil the ET7, in, where it will show, in which auto show, and that it looks like they may have another electric vehicle coming. Now, back to ET7, the range of the top of the line version uh, of NIO ET7 would be more than 1,000 kilometers, which is 620 miles um, of NEDC range, which in the real world could turn out to be close to what the all new Mercedes Benz EQS will offer. Uh, 417 miles um, WTPA, uh, WTP or 770 kilometers. So NIO's ET7 is going to be very competitive. Now here are the main specs. 70 kilowatt hour battery, more than 500 kilometers, 311 miles of NEDC range. 100 kilowatt hour battery will give you 435 miles. See, the previous one was 311 miles. This is 435 miles. If you get 150 kilowatt hour battery it will give you 620 miles which is 1000 kilometers again uh, of the NEDC range now 0 to 60 miles per hour is 3.9 seconds it's uh, the vehicle will have dual motor all-wheel drive system output of 480 kilowatt hour kilowatt and 850 nm of torque front uh, motor um, 100 um, kilometers per hour braking in 33.5 uh, M with Brembo brakes, uh, the CD of 0 0.23, and the dimensions of the NIO ET7 are the following. Length is 5.098 meters, width is 1.987 meters, height is 1.505 meters, and wheelbase of uh, 3.060 meters. So these are the main specs of the NIO uh, ET7, but NIO is going to show the ET7 
27th at April Shanghai Auto Show um, that was revealed for and will reveal the first glimpse of Sedan's production body. And uh, so if you're going to be in Shanghai, uh, take a look at that. Uh, so Shanti Relaxin writes in the Benziga.com saying uh, now use that uh, users and investors are expected to get a more details glimpse of the first ever sedan model later this month. So you know like I said which uh, NIO which unveiled the ET7 sedan at NIO day event held earlier this year is expected to exhibit the model at the Shanghai Auto Show uh, on CNEV Post reported. The show is scheduled to be held April 19 to uh, 28. I don't remember which one it was but I remember that several weeks ago I reported another vehicle will be unveiled and shown at the Shanghai Auto Show. I expect Toyota to have very interesting vehicles unveiled at the Shanghai Auto Show. So those of you who are in China or going to the Shanghai Auto Show please take a look at those it's going to be in very interesting. So interior details of the car will likely be made public at that event. Uh, that report said the CNEV post. Now this follows a statement by a company official put on the NIO up saying that the first ET7 body with the main structure and cover welding assembly rolled off the production line at the FA manufacturing plant in April 1 like I just said like uh, and they said that the statement said this is a very important part of uh, ET7's verification of the manufacturing process confirmation built it can fully identify and solve the problems of the body in the manufacturing stage which is important for future ET7 production. The statement from NIO on up said. Production of the ET7 is advancing in full swing according to the official. The ET7 is scheduled for commercial launch in 2022 friends. Now NIO's William Lee uh, hints at a second electric vehicle sedan model revealing um, rivaling Tesla's Model 3. Like I said, NIO already has three SUVs and the, this ET7 is its first sedan, but it looks like they may have a second sedan rivaling Tesla Model S. Um, Benzinga in Yahoo Finance reports Shanti Relaxin, again the same reporter, saying that the Chinese electric vehicle maker NIO announced a key production milestone Wednesday after which founder and CEO William Lee spoke to the media about the company's near-term goals. Now, here's a production milestone. The company's 100,000 vehicles and ES8 was completed at its Hefei manufacturing base on April 7th. The second sedan is in the works. NIO unveiled its first ever ET7 sedan at the annual NIO day in January with its scheduled commercial launch in the first quarter of 2022. The company is following up with a second sedan model, the CNEV Post reported, citing Lee from the press conference. According to Lee, the proposed model will likely be more competitive than Tesla Model 3. How? I don't know. Last week, Tesla said about 99% of the 184,800 vehicles it delivered during the first quarter were either Model 3 or Model Y. Now, if according to Lee, the proposed model, the second sedan, is going to, will likely be more competitive than said sedan, Tesla's Model 3 sedan, what do you think? In what way NIO using its existing resources, I'm talking about existing or maybe upcoming, can make it a more competitive than Model 3. Price, range, uh, power. Um, let me know what your thoughts are on this, friends. So NIO plans to build more plants, more factories to provide manufacturing capacity for upcoming models, Lee reportedly said. Battery swap station goals are are conservative. NIO's goal of building its 500 battery swap station this year could prove conservative, the report said, citing Lee. The company's internal target will be a little more aggressive and higher, Lee said. Work on the intelligent EV industrial park NIO is building with the Hefei uh, municipal government will begin April 29, he said. And uh, so these are very ex exist exciting developments about NIO EV. I'm going to take a look at that and I'm, I'm at clear, carefully follow what NIO brings to Shanghai, friends, to Shanghai Auto Show at the end of this month and what other 
other automakers bring to Shanghai at the end of this month. I would like to hear your thoughts and I will read them in the comments section below. Friends, this is Armin Haryan from TalkNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and EV breaking news and ring the bell so you don't miss my next uh, coverage. And also, please like this video and give it thumbs up, share in social media if you found it informative. We would greatly appreciate it. Have a blessed day. God bless you, everyone. Peace be with all of you and your families. See you soon in our next report.